The American Cancer Society Complete Guide to Family Caregiving is a little different for family members. I would recommend it because, first of all, it's divided up into chapters about different problems. It takes a problem-solving approach that family caregivers have said is very helpful to them. Because the chapters are problem by problem, they can just go directly to those chapters and get ideas from them. The lists are very creative, and it'll help them get through to the next problems that arise. In the book, we spell out C-O-P-E, which is COPE, and that's an important way to think about problem solving. Creativity means brainstorming with other people, getting information from lots of different sources. O means that the caregivers have an optimistic attitude about what they can do about different problems. P is carrying out a plan that's a step-by-step -step plan to approach reducing symptoms, um, solving problems at home in practical ways, and E is using all the expert information, including this book, that are out there to help them. Uh, family members do take on a primary role within that team. They are not professionals themselves, but we have asked them to do jobs that we used to equip professionals to do. So a book like this is written in a way that helps them fulfill a professional role by knowing something about the problem, knowing when to ask for help, and knowing what to do.